Okay, uh, so you can see uh, for the FCC, there are four number of atoms. Uh, this is being mentioned here in the first point. And uh, uh, the position of those uh, four atoms can be like this. The first atom can be at the origin and the last three atoms can be at the three uh, center of the three faces. Okay, basic faces of the unit cell. Now, which can be, uh, this position can be represented as a half, half, zero, then half, zero, half, and half, uh, and zero, half, half, okay. Now, if you put all these coordinate, coordinates in the expression for structure factor S, then you will have four terms, okay. And uh, you can see like previous thing, let's say if I put, uh, put the first term, Obviously, 0, 0, 0 for all x, sorry, x, y, and z, then obviously uh, it will be exponential 0 and uh, we will get the first term. Similarly, for the second one, from the second one, if you put the second value here uh, as a half half 0 for this xj, yj, and zj, then you will get the expression uh, x exponential i h plus k pi okay now you see l is missing here in this term because uh, uh, this l is zero here okay similarly uh, for the next term we will have k term missing so only uh, h and uh, sorry l term will be missing so h k l so k will be missing h and l will be there yes it is h and l okay and uh, for the last one, uh, H will be, because uh, the first uh, coordinate is 0, so uh, H will be missing, but K and L will be there. It is, you see, K and L are there. And uh, you see, because it is a half, already you are, uh, like previous, when you have the, you have half and you have a 2 here, then they will multiply and give us, uh, they will cut, uh, nullify, okay. Uh, they will give us unit, so we are not considering that term numerical. Okay, now this is the overall expression. Now let us see uh, the various cases. Now la let me take the uh, first case where I have taken all HKL values are even. Okay, now if you take the even value, now uh, let us see what will happen. Uh, if uh, 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 you see. Uh, addition of any two uh, even number is always even. So uh, whether you take h plus k, that will be even. Uh, similarly, h plus l will also be even, and k plus l also will be even because because all uh, individually h k l are even. So their additions and the addition of these two numbers, any of them. To, to numbers will also give us a even. Now exponential, I, I, I told you earlier the exponential uh, uh, i m pi will be 1 if m is equal to if uh, uh, m is equal to even. Now you see this uh, summation is coming, m is the integer, where the, for the first case this is the m, so it is even. Now so this factor will give us one, okay. And this one is uh, the first term, and the second term also give it. Similarly, you will see uh, the third term also will be one. Fourth term also will be one for all the cases. Uh, uh, the, the exponential factor will give us one. So the total will be four. So putting this in geometric uh, structure factor, we will get it. It will be coming. For f, okay, because uh, it is a uh, uh, multiplier application of f into s, where s is the 4. So, f into 4, so it is giving us 4f. Now, what is the xrd peak then intensity? Uh, that will be a square of this uh, geometrical structure factor, which is 4f, which square will give us 4f square, okay. Now, uh, so that means for uh, HKL even, uh, the, we will have the XRD peak. 
So this is the conclusion. Similarly, what will happen if we take the odd? All of them are the odd. Now you see, in this case, uh, again we we, we have uh, this is the expression we ha uh, we have taken. Now uh, now uh, let's say for the first case, uh, uh, h is odd and uh, uh, k also uh, odd. H is odd, k also odd. Now you know uh, when two odd numbers add up, we will give a the value of m, which is also <laughs> Which will which will be even okay now as I told earlier exponential of i m pi is equal to one when m is equal to even so that is then for this will be the case for all other cases uh, for this case also for this case also okay uh, because uh, all of them are odd. And the addition of any two odd number can be even, and the exponential of uh, uh, i uh, even number pi is equal to one. So for that uh, region, s will be again one. One is this one is from the first uh, terms here from this term, and other three terms also give us one. So the s factor will be four, and uh, uh, like previous case, this will be sixteen f square. So now you can see for both of the case 1 and case 2 where uh, h k l uh, all are either even or all of them are odd in both of the cases we will have the xrd peaks. Okay. Now what will happen if we are taking the mixed uh, number. Okay. That means uh, uh, they, uh, they are not either all of them are not odd. Or not, uh, or they are all of them are not even, so they are mixed. Okay, in that case, you can easily prove that s is equal to zero. Okay, in this case, what will happen? Uh, uh, there will be always in s factor, there will be always two positive one plus one, and there will be two minus one. Okay, so the addition will be zero. So, what we can take one example. For example, let me take uh, h k l zero h uh, one zero zero. It's you see one is uh, odd and uh, zero zero are even. Okay. So in this case, uh, if I put here um, uh, in this first case h plus k uh, here h is equal to one, k is equal to zero, and uh, l is equal to zero. Now what about h plus k? H plus k is equal to one plus zero is equal to one, so this is odd. Now uh, you know exponential. Mm, when uh, uh, exponential you are taking for the odd number, uh, exponential i m pi is equal to minus one for m is equal to odd. Okay, that is a general thing that you know. So, because this addition is giving us odd number, that means m is odd. So, so this factor will give us minus one. So, this is what we have got minus one. Similarly, what about uh, h plus l? H, uh, let us see h plus l. H plus l is equal to h is zero. So, h is one, and l is zero. So again odd. Okay. So again this one will give us minus one. Now what about the last term? Uh, last term is k plus l. K is zero and l is zero. So it is zero. Okay. So now uh, exponential of zero is equal to one. So uh, so it will give us one. So now you can see in this expression of s there are two plus one and two minus one. So their addition will be zero. Similarly, you can take the example of uh, one to one. Okay, for, for this case, h is equal to for this case, h is equal to one, uh, k is equal to two, l is equal to l is equal to l is equal to one. So uh, this is a mixed case because this is a uh, odd number, 
and uh, and it is again and it is again odd so in this case let us see what is h plus k h plus k is equal to the first term we will see <coughs> 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 odd okay so when it is odd its exponential i pi uh, will be minus 1 so this one is the first one that is coming from this term again and uh, the second term we found it is minus 1 let us about see the uh, let us see the uh, second term that is uh, uh, h plus l h plus l h plus l is equal to then h is uh, here 1 plus l is 1 so it is 2 it is a even number so its uh, exponential factor will give us plus 1 now what about the last one last one is k plus k plus l uh, k plus l so k is how much k is uh, we have one uh, two and l is one this is the k and this is the l so one so this is three so this is odd so its exponential will give us minus one okay so now you see again in this s factor contains two plus one and two minus one so the addition will be zero again so for all such things you can uh, easily check that for every case s will come as zero so obviously uh, when this uh, uh, multiply with atomic form factor it will give us zero and uh, obviously the xrd peak will not be there so now you see we got the overall conclusion uh, the conclusions are here for fcc For FCC, uh, the XRDP for those plane can exist for which all H scale are either even or odd. Okay, the uh, some examples are examples are one one one. So all of them are odd, so it will exist. Two zero zero. This is all of them are even, so it will exist. Two 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 all of them are even so it will exist similarly 3 0 uh, 3 3 uh, 3 it will exist similarly you can see 3 1 1 can exist or 1 1 3 can exist and so on okay because in this case all of them are odd here uh, also all of them are odd similarly you can put 0 2 2 this can also exist because all of them are even now on the other uh, other when they are uh, as i explained for, uh, for the fcc the xrd uh, for those plane can uh, cannot exist for which hklr mixed example 100 100 you see oh, it is a mixed number so it is it will not exist 1 to 1 mixed 2 1 0 mixed so these are not going to give any xrd peaks so these are sometimes also called as forbidden reflection okay now uh, some of the examples of the uh, mat uh, fcc structure material are silver calcium uh, uh, copper etc okay now uh, for your uh, just uh, awareness, I can show you the XRD peak of nanoparticles. Now, let me tell you, nanoparticles are very important, particularly uh, any kind of nanoparticles are very important at the current technology. Okay, so uh, like silver nanoparticles is very much useful in enhancing the uh, Raman spectroscopy, which are very widely used in biomedical uh, or medical science okay and many other uh, field also so there are several method of finding the nanoparticles or synthesizing the nanoparticle so once you grow them you have to go for the xrd whether you have uh, grown the nanoparticles or not then when you go for the xrd you can see uh, it will give us the peak like this one 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 two zero zero two two zero now you can see these peaks are either uh, even or odd. Therefore, this will give us a. So this is from this. It is 
clear that this uh, silver is a FC6 structures. Okay, so in this way, in the modern physics or in the applied physics, uh, XRD is a very important thing for us to know whether we can we have created the right material or not. Uh, sometimes, very often, we uh, uh, grow the new materials, and uh, for that, we have to go for the their XRD also to know who, uh, in which uh, phase or in which crystal structure it has grown. Okay. Okay, then with this we can end and as I told you, we will have some questions related to these sections uh, that I will separately embed through a, another software and I will give you as a link and uh, that, uh, uh, that uh, through that link in your mobile you can go for this answering the questions in the MCQ mode and you have to submit there. Okay, from that I can know whether you have uh, seen the video or not okay or understood the con content or not thank you